What is going on guys? This is Mike Williams from Cartoon Universe and I have Haley here. Her face is here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so we're, we're uh, continuing on with this format. Uh, a lot of you guys seem to like it from the last Pink Diamond video, so we're going to do this. Now we have more of a podcast discussion type thing because there's more than one person here. Um, so obviously, as you can tell by the title, this is a miraculous video and we're going to be talking about all those Kwame that we saw, which we were not expecting that. I wasn't expecting that. Um, oh, yeah, no, definitely not. Yeah, because we knew there was, like, another floor of Kwame or whatever floor, on like, in that box, but I did not think they were all just going to pop out right there. Um, but it looks like there's actually some missing. So if you take a look at the screen, uh, we got dragon, snake, goat, monkey, dog, pig, and bull. Bull, I think, is technically supposed to be ox, um, because these are all animals of the zodiac, uh, Chinese zodiac. Um, and there's actually four missing. There's usually 12 uh, in the Chinese Zodiac, um, but there's actually just eight here. So I'm pretty sure, I don't remember, did, uh, did they confirm that there are uh, definitely other Kwamis other places in the world? They confirmed there's other superheroes, but did they confirm there's other Kwamis? I don't know about that. Like, I, I haven't heard anything about that, not to my knowledge. Um, yeah, because right now we think that all the Kwamis are in that in there but yeah if there's mm -hmm. other superheroes that would, that would make sense yeah so there's probably other Kwame's missing this could have to do with uh marinette going to china we do know that she's going to be doing that that was a good special that was confirmed uh so maybe since it's the chinese zodiac maybe the rest of them are somewhere else that's actually in china that'd be pretty cool but the ones that are missing are rat rabbit horse and rooster so i'm not sure what the significance is there um but these are all chinese zodiac um animals so we're going to basically talk about what we think the powers are going to be we actually have quite a few references that we could use to kind of deduce right. this uh because if you as you know by now um the ladybug represents good luck in real life as well uh black cat refer represents bad luck so that's cat noirs you know cataclysm all that stuff and the foxes usually represent illusion and mischief and all that stuff and that's mm -hmm. obviously what uh rena rouge's powers are um so we're gonna kind of go based off of that and what these animals all represent as far as the Chinese Zodiac, and we actually have some pretty legit source material to go off of. Uh, <laughs> that, oh yeah, the yeah. most legit. Yes, relatively legit. At least well, at least one of them is legit. Um, to go off of and kind of deduce what each of these powers might be. Um, before we get into that, do you think we're gonna see these, like, all of these, at, like, in the play, like, people actually using them, or do you think some of them are just for show and we're not gonna actually see every single one of them? Um, well, if going by my theory of what I've been talking about for a while, is that, like, Marinette's classmates get them, she gives them out to, you know, right. most of them, or if not all of them, or some extra people, uh, that means we'd see all of them. So, and it matches up decently well, like, there's, like, oh, there might be a few too many, if you mm -hmm. count, like, all the classmates we've seen are people who go to that school in particular but if you just count the ones we saw in like the picture um when miss their class took like a group photo then it's not enough if you can okay you consider 12 yeah gotcha cool so i guess we'll have to wait and see for that we could potentially do a whole nother video on that but that's a whole oh, nother yeah. thing um so yeah so here i'm going to go to our list of stuff okay so we've got the Power Listings Wiki here. Uh, Wiki is always a very reliable <laughs> source. Oh, yeah. um, but honestly, all right. I hear what, this side note. I think Wiki actually is pretty reliable because they have people that edit this stuff and uh, make sure the sources yeah. are correct. So, um, and based off of what we've other research we've done, he seemed to be pretty legit. Um, so, if you're not familiar with the Power Listing Wiki, it's basically a wiki that's all about superpowers. Uh, it's actually pretty useful if you're like writing an action show, show or story. Okay, there's some lollies. Um, so this is basically just gonna uh, talk about this uh, and what what every single power is. So all of them have elements. I don't know if those are gonna come into play necessarily. I think for some specific ones they might, um, but I don't think they're all gonna have. Oh, snake, horse, and sheep all have fire powers. Like I don't think that's gonna happen. Um, so I think this is just more so Chinese representation. Um, I don't think they're gonna go the element route. We haven't gone the element route yet. Uh, so granted, they're not the animals we have aren't actually part of the Chinese zodiac, so it's a little different. Um, but we have rat is animation. Uh, so do you think that's like reanimation or um, like what kind of animation do you think they're referring to here? Does animate this, inanimate um, objects? According to the wiki, it's the power to animate inanimate objects. Mm. So like 
And if you want, like, a doll or something, probably. Right. Something like that. Gotcha. Yeah, that, so, that makes sense. rats, I don't, like, what we know from, like, what we've seen of rat characters that are rats, like, I mean, they're usually, like, not the best characters, like, mm -hmm. have a bad rap to them, so I guess I could see that. Um, I don't know where that come that whole animate reanimation or animation thing comes right. from. Right. But I mean, it's not the biggest stretch, I'd say. <laughs> yeah, and it's like it brings like clay animation, elemental animation. So this could be like sort of some avatar type stuff, or <laughs> uh, object animation. So that's like bringing stuff to life. But maybe uh, could telekinesis be a thing? Maybe does that count as animation? It's not on the list. So that might that might that not means count. Similar. I know, but bringing things to life is different than, like, moving stuff with your mind. Right. Like, see, here the pit, they have a picture of, like, some gargoyle. Okay, some, gotcha. Yeah, stone object. Oh, or not, actually, that's an ink painting. Oh, and this little gift. Never mind. Right. But I'm pretty sure, like, stone objects, too. Gotcha. So here's some examples. Uh, not going to go through every single one of them, uh, especially since I don't even remember most of these. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, these, these all make sense. Um, so we're going to go to the next one. Uh, ox is super strength, so this is listed as the ball in the, the previous picture, uh, but super strength, that's pretty self-explanatory. Mm -hmm. uh, it's super strength, is very basic stuff. I wonder how that's going to fall into place with their specific item, uh, because, you know, or power, because uh, Marinette has the lucky charm, Agent has the cataclysm, so I wonder what the special thing would be for, like, super strength, you know what I mean? Because I would imagine super strength would just be active the whole time, because... It's just general superpowers. Maybe the super strength doesn't activate until then, and then it just they're just able to lift really heavy objects or something like that. Hmm. That's interesting. Yeah, I mean, it's just like even more strength when right. he activates his power, or like something. Well, yeah, because I would say like breaking something, but that's what mm. Cataclysm does already. So right. Yeah, no point there. Yeah, so it could just be like you just have to lift. You'd be able to lift like a building or something exactly. insane, yeah. okay, or. That's yeah, some crazy endurance, like maybe, like, I don't know. I don't think they're gonna have bullets in Miraculous. It's a little, it's a little too, uh, it's a little too heavy, but they like someone shoots bullets or something and it just bounces right off, stuff like that. Superman stuff, essentially. Um, and then we have Tiger, which is balance. Um, so it says yin and yang manipulation. So this one's super duper interesting. So you mentioned something about this potentially relating to uh, Ladybug Cat Noir, right? Yeah, because if you look at Ladybug Cat Noir's, like, in the jeweler box where the little miraculouses are, it forms a yin and yang mm -hmm. um, symbol. So, it, and then the yin and yang manipulation is the ability to manipulate these forces. So, right. my logic is, well, if Ladybug and Cat Noir represent yin and yang, then maybe they can manipulate uh, the tiger, I believe, right? Yes, the tiger. <laughs> manipulate them although it's called balance i yeah maybe it's just like or perhaps the word balance brings to mind like kind of making people calm them down or something um could be yeah yeah like balancing their minds or like you know it's like a counteract to the hawk uh no the moth miraculous um mm -hmm. it could like you know un that'd be that'd be a little overpowered just un yeah it's un 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 immediately <laughs> Yeah. I mean, it's not, it could be something like that, maybe. Um, so the user has power over yin and yang, natural dualities of polar opposites or seemingly contrary forces that are interconnected and independent in the natural world and how they give rise to each other in turn in relation to each other. Uh, with many distinct natural dualities, uh, dark light, female, male, blah, blah, blah. So this could also just go beyond just the, you know, uh, cat and uh, ladybug miraculouses. Could go to other stuff as well. And then we got rabbit, which is super speed. Again, that's pretty... Self-explanatory, you go fast. Gotta go fast. Okay, so actually with the rabbit, it's interesting because we actually did get a picture, kind of leaked picture, I believe, of like some concept art of all the new Kwamis, what they're going to look like. It's amazing, but we mm. don't want to show it because we don't want this video to get taken down. Um, we've had some issues yeah, Don't in the past. Don't snipe us, please. Eh? Yeah, don't please, snipe us. Please, no, we're not showing it, <laughs> we promise. Um, and the interesting thing about that was is that we saw 10, or no, we saw 11 of the 12 animals. So I'm wondering... Uh, did they not include one for a reason, or was it just since it was so um, concept art, it was such mm. a quick concept that they are like, we'll get to the rabbit later. You know, yeah. 11 out of 12 is good enough for now. Yeah, and I think that was the only one we didn't see in that picture. Yeah, that's right. yeah definitely. It's one of the four that is not in the box. Uh, so, 
presumably it is somewhere else in the world, potentially China or something like that. Interesting, um, yeah. But yeah, it, it just may have been left off as a mistake or something like that. Cause it seemed like a pretty quick video. Uh, I don't even know if it was really supposed to even get out. So uh, I think it was just kind of not there <laughs> for whatever reason. Um, and then we got Dragon, which is super dope. Also, side note, why is like... Oh, they got all these regular animals for Chinese Zodiac, and they have dragon. It's just like, that's like not even fair. <laughs> Dragons were real. I know, it's just like, but they're so much cooler and badass than every other animal. <laughs> I mean, tiger's pretty cool. Yeah, tiger's pretty cool, but it's not a dragon. Um, yeah, true. Nothing is a dragon. <laughs> Michael. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. This is this is fact. Um, but yeah, this is, has uh, combustion inducement. Um, so that's kind of like that. But it's 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 a, it's a sub power fire manipulation. So I'm guessing if you've ever seen Avatar, it's like Sparky Sparky Boom Man. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yep, exactly. right there. Uh, so you just it kind of makes explosions. So it's sort of like fire fire bending, but it's like kind of a subcategory of that. Um, so that'd be pretty dark <laughs> to include a miraculous i feel like unless they're going to start going a d darker route uh i don't know how they could really implement combustion in miraculous sure without it being it drastic be somebody that can breathe fire or something yeah fire, something that'd simple be, that'd be my guess just regular fire yeah <laughs> yeah then we've got snake which is invisibility again pretty self-explanatory you can turn invisible um i can see a lot of episodes like having a lot more options at, like with all these powers and like if we see all these powers it'd be really interesting um horse is power of healing so that'll probably come in handy in some really serious fights that might come up soon uh we know hawk moth is gonna have a boss which is you know most likely the peacock miraculous holder so if that happens and then that boss gets really serious because hawk moth is garbage at his job uh <laughs> and things start like get knocked up a notch um then we might see some healing because you know hawk moth pretty much sucks um and then we have uh, sheep which is astral projection so that's basically like loki um <laughs> doctor strange type stuff you kind of just project an image uh I, I don't know what uses that would really have in miraculous but it just I mean, kind of depends on the episode and the enemy that they're yeah. facing really then we've got monkey which is animal morphing that's kind of metal meta because monkey is an animal and then all the other miraculouses are animals so i don't know it's kind of weird uh but yeah again pretty self-explanatory you can morph into another animal and then we've got rooster which is levitation that seems like the lamest one so far <laughs> uh I mean, yeah i can yeah, float roosters can't even fly <laughs> Uh, okay, that works, I guess. Uh, and then we've got Dog, which is Immortality. Hello? What? I'm sorry? <laughs> How do you think that's gonna come into play? Because that's a super OP power. Yeah, I, I don't know. That's, yeah, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> what, um, I mean, obviously, like, somebody will want to steal, probably just want to steal that power. You'll try to see mm -hmm. something like that going on, uh, potentially, because that's, like, a, yeah, a very powerful one. Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't know, because that's almost, I don't know, I mean, we don't know to what extent better than, oh, I mean, obviously the Ladybug and Cat Miraculouses are the top from what we, what we know. Right, yeah, because they combine. This is pretty, the pretty good deal. Yeah, yeah uh, the only thing that makes sense would be, like, regeneration, uh, mm -hmm. which kind of falls under oh. healing, uh, but maybe it's just, like, for your own body, but, like, that's, like... I mean, I, what, do you think somebody's going to get their leg knocked Yeah, I was about to say, like, that's the thing about this show. It's like, it's so light. Um, Very tame compared to yeah. shows. Yeah. Uh, levels of immortality, unfettered body cannot age, wow. body is completely immune to physical damage, so that could be it. Like, okay, it could, yeah, be, that could be, it. that could be the endurance thing, like I mentioned, for the super strength. Maybe that's, like, more of a, just physically able to, so, like, once they activate whatever power they have, like, the cataclysm or lucky charm, whatever, they can do, like, their little uh, unharmed ability thing to kind of just endure whatever they need to endure so if there's like a fire somewhere they can just walk through the fire no problem wow um, yeah so that, that's so that still pretty problem. pretty dang powerful yeah it's still pretty <laughs> still pretty broken yeah. and then pig is heat vision that makes so much sense oh my for God. reasons i guess uh, i guess because bacon <laughs> that's all i can think of <laughs> like, pig. That's all I can think. yeah i don't okay heat vision you got heat vision very specific that's a very specific power like, i feel like all these powers generally are pretty they're pretty widespread especially uh -huh. spec except for like maybe combustion but heat vision I, it doesn't even match pick like, it's so weird uh so yeah that's the thing so 
So something interesting that I don't did you mention where we there, these powers came from? Uh yeah, they're the power listing wiki. Um Yeah, but like where they actually came from. Well Jackie Jack <laughs> yeah. Chan Adventures. This may have been the source. We're not sure if this is the only thing, only yeah. source that's ever done this. Uh so if you know about other Chinese Zodiac shows that have yeah. utilized the stuff, then it also could have been a thing. Uh, maybe it's a common thread that all these animals have these powers. But so far, it looks like it pretty much adds up for the most part. Rooster has levitation. Also telekinesis, so that could be a thing. Uh, that sounds like a more useful power than uh, just floating. Yeah. And you've got uh, the ox talisman strength. Snake is invisibility. Rabbit is speed. Uh, sheep's astral projection or dream possession, which would be pretty cool. We've got some Steven Universe action happening. Um, <laughs> dragon talisman is combustion. Rat is animation. Horses healing slash regeneration, so that's kind of iffy there with the uh, dog immortality thing. Then you've got shape-shifting for the monkey. Uh, so there could just be general shape-shifting. Maybe it's not just animal stuff because the uh, superpower wiki says it's just animals. So this could it could just be all general shape-shifting, which I think would be more useful probably uh, writing-wise. And then we've got immortality and then rejuvenation. Regeneration is like healing yeah, yourself. Yeah, like what's the difference? Rejuvenation is bringing somebody else back. Making someone or something look or feel better. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm not bringing back, I guess. Right. Kind of restoring, sort of. Yeah. So, like. themselves and then others. So, yeah, they're another healer. Yeah, so that sounds similar to regeneration. So, I guess they would just have to distinct that. Um, again, heat vision. Because <laughs> pig, I guess. And tiger is balance. So, that all pretty much adds up. Uh, if you've never seen Jack Jan Avengers, definitely recommend it. It's, it's a damn good cartoon. And yeah, so that's basically the powers right there. Uh, we're probably going to talk about who is getting what miraculous, uh, based off like the different personality traits of all the Zodiac, Chinese Zodiac, and all the characters that we know so far. So we can kind of maybe deduce and also color schemes as a thing with the show. So yeah, that's pretty much it for that. Those are most likely going to be the general powers, but we'll probably do a separate video. This went on way longer than we planned. Uh, we'll probably do a separate video where we kind of talk about what uh every single miraculous what miraculous yeah. is going to which person based off of their different personalities and the personality traits of the different chinese zodiacs uh so yeah do you have any last thoughts Haley? i'm excited for uh the pig's heat vision definitely you know <laughs> heat so, vision yeah bacon yeah <laughs> and hopefully not itself it won't cook himself yeah but, you know I, i'm just some of these are curious i mean we're just going off literally check jackie chain adventures there's Take this stuff with a grain of salt for like a couple of these. Yeah. I was yeah. gonna say. Cause and it makes sense ridiculous. though. Yeah. What? Most of them make sense because I, I think they a lot do, of them re it, represent these certain things and stuff like yeah. that. So, yeah. Yeah. I mean, because Jackie Chan Adventures probably chose like ones that made sense, mm -hmm. except for the ones that like this animal has <laughs> like no power people associated with. Let's give yeah. it rejuvenation. <laughs> yeah. Mortality. Yeah. So, so yeah. I'm, I'm excited though. Very excited. I can't wait to see them in action cool. all their personalities and whatnot i love kwame so much where yeah hopefully it doesn't take 20 episodes but what do you guys think do you think it's going to represent these more or less do you think they might have other powers let us know in the comments down below and uh, if you're new here be sure to subscribe hit that notification bell so you can be notified when we do the next video and all the other miraculous videos that we got on the way and if you enjoyed this video be sure to leave it a like thank you guys so much for tuning in i'm like williams you can watch cartoon universe see you in the next Bye. video